Dang, bro. I got to just do nothing, bro. Dang, bro. My booty hurt, man. Dang, bro. I need to take a two now. Gosh, boy. Oh, hey, what the hell, bro? Bro, but I need to take a two right now, bro. So what you gonna do? You gonna let me sit down or what? Bro, are you for real? I know you're not trying to sit on me with that dusty booty you got. Those earrings you got on, they finna turn green. And your ear finna fall off. And that cussy crab hat you got on, take it off. Mr. Krabs don't wanna hire your sea monkey looking ass. Bro, dang, you get no hoes, bro. You single, you finna be like this for the rest of your life. I know you're not trying to talk, bro. One, everybody sit on your mouth, bro. That's that's terrible. That's mad disrespect. See, personally, I wouldn't let that happen. Two, you the butt of all jokes, bro. Everybody crap on you, bro. You're trash, bro. Don't come for me, bro. I don't want to hear nothing, bro. And me getting getting hoes, bro. I sit on you, bro. You you eat my hairy booty all the time. I don't want to hear nothing. <laughs> But I'm really not trying to argue with you, and I need to take a number two. So what's gonna be like? Can I please just use the like? Can I please just use the bathroom, bro? Like, I'm not trying to argue, bro. All right, bro. Just this one. No. What's getting jiggy, YouTube? It's CIMZX LAPPS, and welcome to Toilet Talk. You feel me? Yeah. Welcome to Toilet Talk, you feel me? So, today's topic, oh, y'all gonna like this topic, it's so funny. <laughs> today's topic, we are talking about the worst whooping I got as a kid. Out of all my family members, bruh, the one person I have to select, bro, is my, mm, my grandpa. Oh! But my mom used to tell me stories about my grandpa all the time when she was younger. Like, I usually think she was dragging it, but I promise you she's not dragging it, bro. But when my mom was little, bro, my mom be like, bro, if you did, like, if you came home with, like, any type of C's, D's, or F's, bro, in the, and, like, on your report card, bro, you getting a butt whooping, bro. Oh, my gosh. My mom made sure she had A's and D's, bro. Straight A's, bro. I'm in elementary school. I think I'm in like first or second grade. I forgot what grade. But no, I was in first grade. I was in first grade. So it was snack time. Well, it wasn't snack time, but it was about to be snack time. And I haven't eaten lunch or nothing. Like, bro, I'm starving. Like, bro, I'm hungry. My stomach is hurting. You feel me? So I'm like, bro, let me go get some cheeses. Like, she passes out cheeses. You feel me? To like, um, to the kids that don't have like snacks and stuff. So I was like, bro, you know what? I'm finna go give me, I'm finna go give me some cheeses. So she had him sitting on the like on the counter next to the seat. So I'm like, you know what? All right, fine. I'm finna go steal some cheeses. You feel me? I'm finna go steal some cheeses. So I walk up there like, bro, I'm like, I'm like trying to make my way not knowing that I'm walking to the like the cheeses box. You feel me? So I'm over there like, not. I'm like, I'm looking keep kept coming, but I'm like, hello. Miss Smith! Oh, that's also her name. Her name is Miss Smith. So, bro, I'm walking up to get, I'm like tiptoeing. I'm walking up to get my cheeses, you feel me? I'm like, damn, bro, I'm finna eat good. I stick my hand in there. And I didn't even stick like, I didn't even go like this. I went like this. So I grabbed it by my fingers. I didn't even grab a lot, you feel me? I just grabbed a couple and then I ate some, you feel me? Bro. The moment I put them in my mouth, bruh, it's like the, like the presence of the room just changed. Like, bruh, I promise you, bruh, she just teleported oh behind me. Like, all I just hear is, not seer. What are you doing? Nigga, bro, I'm telling you, bruh, my jaw, jaw, I'm saying you're like, oh. I'm like, bruh, that's all I'm looking, bruh. I promise you, I'm looking like that. She's like, bro, what are you doing? And I was like, bro, nothing. And she was like, are you eating cheeses before snack time? And I was like, no. <laughs> you know how you start crying like before before the situation even escalate even further? Cause you you already know you messed up. So you're just like, no. Like, you know, you know I was just like that, bro. I already folded, bro. Like, bro. <laughs> And she already knew because she the box was open, you feel me? So I just lied to her, you feel me? So she was like, you know what? Go to the red. Like, she was like, put your clip on the red thing. 
Now, if y'all know what that is, I'm pretty sure y'all all know what that is. Do I really have to explain? So anyway, there's a, there's a behavior chart. You feel me? You got the green, the yellow, and then you got the red. She told me to skip the yellow. She said, go to red. I said, oh my God, bro, I'm gonna die. So I'm walking over there, I'm like, oh my God, I already knew it, bro. I already knew it, bro, I already knew it. So I go over there, I clip the green, and then I clip the yellow, and then I clip the red. The reason why I did it like that, because I was just like, I don't even know, I just did it like that. I just didn't want to put it straight to red. I don't know why, but. But I got a red face, bro. So, and during snack time, I didn't even get no cheeses neither. So, like, Miss me! So, so, it's the end of the day, bro. I'm shivering in my boots. I'm like, bro, I already know what's going to happen. Like, when I get when I get home, bro. I'm going to get it when I get home, bro. My granddad does not play, bro. I'm telling you. My granddad will, bro. My granddad, make sure you come home with straight greens. If you do not have greens, bro, you're dead, bro. So it's the end of the day. She's getting everybody's planner. You feel me? She automatically calls me. Not nah, here. Come here. Bring your planner. I'm like, all right, bro. I give her my planner, and she put the like. I already seen it. Like she put the red thing right on there, and then she makes it, bro. She's writing this long note, bro. And I'm like, oh my gosh, a note too. Dang, bro, I thought I could get away, but she ran in a note, bruh. So I didn't even want to look at the note, bruh. I put it in my book bag, and I leave, you feel me? The bell rings, and I have to go to the uh, parent pickup. So I'm sitting in parent pickup, and I'm waiting for my granddad to come pick me up. Yo, I'm saying, like, I'm shivering, bro. Like, bro, it's hot as heck outside. I know I got on a jacket, and I'm still cold. Like, I'm like, bro, I got on one of them freaking puffer jackets on. Like, I'm from New York. Like, bro, come on, bruh. Mind you, he works at a barber shop, right? And it's down the street. Bro, I'm telling you, he picked me up, right? And I sit in, I sit in the back seat. So he was like, no, I see it, how's school? I'm like, good. I'm like, I already folded it in. Like, he already knew. Like, oh my gosh, I couldn't even held it up because I already knew what type of butt whooping I was finna get, bro. Like, oh my gosh, I'm telling you, bro. He used to put, bro, he used to put fear in me for sure, bro. He was like, oh, something must have happened. We'll wait till we get to the barbershop. But the barbershop is not even that far. It's down the street. That was the quickest ride I have ever been on. Like, bro, that ride was literally like two seconds long. I promise you. We get out, bro. I'm taking my sweet little time. Like, I'm packing all my pencils, my crayons, my papers. Like, I'm trying to pack everything slowly so I don't have to go in the barbershop. Bro, we finally walk in the barbershop. Like, I tell you, I'm walking like that. I'm walking my head down. I'm like, now see, you messed up. We went inside. He pulled out a little table. You feel me? He pulled out a little table. He'd be like, all right, sit right here next to me. And then he opened up my planner. And he's like, get your planner out your book bag. So I get my planner out my book bag. And my booty is clenched right now, like how it is on this toilet seat. Before I keep going, bro, we finna have a quick commercial break, bro. Need to take a dump. Oh! I need you guys to follow my Instagram, you feel me? It will be in the description, you feel me? Follow my Instagram, and please hit the subscribe button, bro. Please hit the subscribe button. If you're new, please hit the subscribe button. And go into the comment section and say that I subscribe. If you have, I will reply to you, you feel me? So, I sit right next to him, you feel me? And he's like, bro, get your planner out your book bag. I'm like, yo, bro, it's over. Over. You feel me? And he opened it up. He went straight to the pen. Like, he already knew. He, boom, he just pulled it out. Like, he was like... He, like, it was just a moment of silence, bro. But like, he was just reading it. Like, every bit of ink that was on that paper, he was scanning it with his... He was scanning it so hard, bro. Like, he was not missing nothing off that letter, bro. But this is exactly how she said it. So she wrote it in. She was like, um, Mr. Harris... I reportedly have seen Nasir stealing cheeses before snack time, and when I had asked him, he had lied to me and said that he didn't eat the cheeses. So the next time this happens again, or the, or the, or this situation happens again, I will send him to the principal's office and have him read it up. Oh, that literally sent it. And mind you, we know the principal, like, my bro, the principal goes to the barbershop, you feel me, that my granddad cuts hair at, you feel me, because he owns the barbershop, 
they know each other really well. So if anything was to happen, it's most definitely finna come back to me, bro. Like, and he will most definitely know about it. He goes to the barbershop and gets his haircuts from my granddad. You feel me? So, bro, like, what? Like, bro, I'm telling you, he was furious, bro. He said, Nasir, this is what you're doing at school? You're stealing? And I told him, I was like, bro, I was hungry. Like, I didn't have any cheese. And he said, I do not care. And you lied on top of that. What have I told you about that? I was like, oh I was like, bro, I wanted the cheese, bro. I was hungry, bro. Like, what am I supposed to do, Miss Smith? Starve? Everybody else had lunch. I ain't have nothing. I had to pay. And I didn't have any money. Bum. He's like, you're gonna get it when you get home. When we get home, you're getting it. This shift finally is like, he gets off at like, eight o'clock bro i'm telling you that whole time i was sleeping i don't know what it is with me but like when i get in trouble or like something bad is about to happen i'll always go to sleep like i don't know i just go to sleep i'm pretty do y'all ever feel like that too like put that in the comment section do y'all ever like when something bad is about to happen do y'all like ever go to sleep i don't know <laughs> whatever but yeah i was sleep the whole time like bro that, those hours went by so fast like damn bro the moment i closed my eyes it was already time to go i was like damn it's out of there. We get in the car. We in Fort Pierce. We in Fort Pierce, Florida. So we have to drive all the way to Melbourne. You feel me? I don't know how long it is. I'm going to just say it's like a 40 minute drive. I'm like, that's how good I'm estimated right now. I don't know. I'm just saying it's like a 40 minute drive, but it's a long drive. You feel me? I'm telling you. I went to sleep in that car. I opened my eyes. We were already there. I was like, yo. You for real? We teleported here. He was not having it. He was ready. I get inside the crib, you feel me? I'm the first one in the house, you know what I'm saying? First thing, yo, draws, take them! Oh, God, bro. Oh, hell no, man. What the fuck, man? What are you doing? He's like, bro, take your draws off and go to the bathroom before it gets critical, you feel me? I'm gonna tell y'all what happened. I'm in there sitting. I'm sitting on the toilet. I'm trying to get, I'm trying to, you know what I'm saying? I'm just sitting on the toilet naked, bro. I'm like, Bro, this is the worst whooping I'm finna get, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. I hear the footsteps. Oh, yo, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. He walks in. This man came in with this. This man came in with nothing. He came in with nothing. He came in with his bare hands. Like, he just came in like this. Oh, hell no. He said, all right, bro, you finna get hey. 10 spankings, bro. But since you getting in trouble at school and you what lied and you stole yeah. it, you can't play. You know how old people's hands are dry and they rough. So you know when he smacked you, bro, your skin is going to come off on his hand. The skin is going to be left on his hand. You finna have no skin in that area. Bro, I didn't even want to look, bro. Wow! I was in that I'm telling you, bro. He did that 10 times, bro. I promise you, bro. After I was done, bro, I promise you my booty was looking like a red bad boo booty. Like, you know what I'm talking about? Like, that's how my booty was looking. And I don't know why why parents or grandparents, I don't know why they do this. Like, like you get a butt whooping and they, they expect you to be like, yo, thank you for that butt whooping you gave me. I needed that. Like, like, you think I'm gonna be cool with you? Like, he would be like, he'd be like, after I'm done getting the whooping, he'd be like, all right, now nah, hug me. Like, I'd be like, what do you mean? Like, bro, you just whooped me. Like, come on, bro. You gonna tell me to hug you after you just gave me the worst whooping of my life, bro? It's that old man power. And plus, you know, he'd be messing with them clippers all the time. So he he just got it in his wrist. So he just, like, he he already knew. He just swatted out of it. Like, swat the fly out of there like this, you feel me? <coughs> Telling you, bro, I was not able to sit down when I got to school the next day. I, I'm being so for real. Like, I sit down, bro, and I would just remember how sore my booty was. Like, bro, never again. I do not want to have a butt whooping like that ever again. Like, ever. I don't even think my kid deserves that, bro. Like, and I don't know what it was, but his hands just hurt. Like, his hands just are rough. Like, I don't know. I don't know. But, yeah, that's it for today. Well, that's it for Toilet Talk, you feel me? Um, put in the 
comment section, what's the worst whooping y'all ever had? Like, bro, let me know, bro. Have y'all ever got whooped with a stitch, a belt, I'm pretty sure, a cord, a flip flop, a frying pan? <laughs> hey, bro. Hey, people get whooped with everything nowadays, bro. You feel me? Shoot. You, hey, I'll whoop you with my iPhone too. You feel me? Anywho. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoy. Please hit the subscribe button. Shoot the like button for a boy. And if you are new to this channel, please hit the subscribe button. Turn on notifications. You feel me? And when you subscribe, type I subscribed in the comment section. If you do that, I will reply back to you. You feel me? On the road to 300 subscribers, bro. Let's get it. And I'll see you in the next one.